I'm Jules Atzel, Craft Centre. I'm just with Nige here um, from Ground Force in Knaresborough and as you can see behind us we've been hard at work today laying the sand for the urban beach for Fever. Um, and I just wanted to take a moment just to have a quick chat with Nige. Uh, Nige or Nigel? Nige. Nige. Hello, Nige. Um, so, yeah. Nige really, really kindly, um, him and his team from Ground Force turned up today and have been driving the machinery to bring the sand in and they've done this out of the goodness of their heart. So, I was just going to ask them a couple of questions. One, did you come to Fever last year? I didn't. No, no. no. I will this year. Yeah, yes. so you've, you heard about Fever through how, how did you hear well, about Well, I've known about Fever. Yeah. Uh, obviously, I'm a natural artist, so it's yeah. things you can't really miss. Um, but I heard about the needing some help through Facebook. Yep. Uh, obviously, once I saw it, I was keen to get involved, and here we are. So, Ground Force, um, you local based? Yeah, we're Nesbo based. It's, it's yeah. Yorkshire Ground Force. Yeah, Yorkshire Ground Force, sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, we're a Nesbo based company. Mm -hmm. uh, we specialise in all aspects of ground works and artificial craft as well. Very good. Yeah, we've been talking about, um, obviously, underneath here, we have had actually to take all the grass up as well. So nice, very kindly giving us some advice about possibly putting down some artificial grass and saving ourselves some money next year because we have to take the grass up. Um, so um, what sort of projects do you generally work on then? Well, normally it's uh, domestic, you know, people's front gardens, back gardens, um, but we take them out all right okay well um we just wanted to say a huge thank you to you guys it's so so grateful um you've turned up you've been an absolute dream they've just got on with it they've handled the whole project they've just got in here sorted everything out um, and I believe they're willing to stay late and after their hours as well to help us with the next load to fill the rest of it up. Um, but also, um, you know, just the fact that it's a local business that's really sort of come on board, giving us their time. And, and especially when you're sort of a local business, it's really difficult on your budget to give time. Um, so thank you so, so much. Nice to give something back. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>